Hey, uh, this is Tyrone Taylor with um, Junkers101.com, also known as TheFlipMan.com. Um, today I want to talk about, um, uh, just reply to a, a question that was asked on one of the uh, other uh, videos about can you assign your uh, contract twice. And uh, before I answer that, uh, please rate the video. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, uh, definitely include them here on the video. I'll be happy to get back with you or either create a video um, in response to a question. Um, but to go on with it, um, yes, you can assign um, a contract twice. Um, it really no limit on it, especially if cash is involved. It's just whatever you, uh, your buyer and your seller are willing to do, really just you and your buyer. Um, but um, I've done that maybe only once that I could just think of off the top of my head. But it was a situation, actually, um, most of you all probably are familiar with home investors. Um, and that's basically a franchise that uh, teaches you how to wholesale. And, you know, it's a, it's a huge investment, but they are basically uh, whole, a wholesale uh, investment uh, franchise um, it's strange you know you, it's pretty expensive to get involved but you know it, it works you know so um, but anyway the guy um, that that was here that the first franchise that opened here uh, in uh, in Birmingham um, he somehow we met I don't know what he did to uh, to find me but you know uh, we actually started about the same time may have been a little ahead of them so they were just trying to get their feet wet in the business and so they were just just going through the networking process of trying to to find who knows um, how to move deals and at that time I had done a few um, so the guy had a property and he asked me could uh, uh, I help him move the property and uh, where it was located you know I knew I had buyers um, for that area um, matter of fact um, it's, it's, a, it's, it's, it's an area um, that I haven't done a deal since then. It's one of those, at Birmingham is strange. In some areas of town, <clears throat> it's hard to obtain property. And there's some, some of the more attractive areas, not really expensive areas, but it's just a situation where the only way you're going to acquire those properties after the uh, owners die and their kids sell it. Um, that's just about the only way that you're going to get But some of them are some really attractive investment areas. But anyway, so um, he had this property on the contract, and uh, he had it at one price. I don't even know what he made off the deal, actually, uh, just to think about it. But I only ended up making uh, 5000 off of it. Um, I know he made a, quite a bit more, but I wasn't concerned about that as long as I got my five k. But basically, uh, I went into contract with him, even though he knew I was going to wholesale the property. And so at that point, that's when uh, he... Uh, my buyer and myself showed up, and my buyer viewed the property, and um, and that's that's it basically. And my buyer and I went into an agreement, and so whenever we closed on it, there were two assignments fees paid, uh, one to uh, home investors um, and whatever their LLC was at the time, and um, and me. Uh, and so it was really that simple. But the only thing about that, um, that buyer now becomes his buyer because. That's what he does also as a wholesaler. So, which, you know, I'm not greedy. You know, I'm not going to be able to find all the houses or, or make all the deals by no means. I'm, you know, just uh, not even bleep on the radar. But um, with this business, you don't have to be on the radar to make a really, really good li uh, living. But understand, though, once you do a double assignment, if if you're providing a buyer, that buyer is now going to become that wholesaler's buyer also. Um, if you look at that in a negative light, then it's a negative. It's a negative as far as doing a double assignment. It didn't matter to me. You know, it is what it is. You know, most guys, they don't care where the deals come from if the numbers work. But uh, this is just a tip on, yes, you can do uh, double assignments even beyond that, especially if cash is involved from the buyer. Um, this is Tyrone Taylor. Definitely take advantage of all the videos I have here online. Uh, also at um, a website, junkers101.com or... Uh, theflipman.com is which may be easier to uh, remember. Um, still offer the uh, one on one course um, online with uh, me walking you through your first three deals, and also I will come to your city for three days 
and train you one on one, and that comes with lifetime mentoring. Uh, good luck. Don't hesitate to call me, text, comment, rate the video. Uh, you can call me at 205 492 3425. Thanks. Have a great day.